building oh i'm finna get mad i'm finna get mad i think this bitch just deleted my whole universe Bruh. you better not 2k oh you better not 2k bro Bruh. what You wait till I turn the stream on, then hit me with this. What up, King? Wow, bro. I'm. Bruh. Oh, I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I had the full card, everything loaded up, and now it's froze.
2K, you can't be serious, bruh. I done did all this shit building up this universe and this first show in this first week. All I had to do was hit start, and then it, it gave me that. It gave me that when I was about to hit start. Now the bitch froze. All right. Fucking game, bro. This fucking game. I already don't feel good. I ain't feeling the best, but I wanted. I promised y'all DKF, and I was gonna give it to you. And here we go with this shit. Let's try it again, man. What did he have to do? He had to start all the way over. D well, what's good? I'm gonna be pissed if I gotta redo all this shit. Like, highly pissed. What? I know like all my titles, all that shit better be there. That's that's all I <laughs> Whoo, we starting off bad. We starting off bad. My titles are there. Alright. Bro, I did so many tag teams. I don't want to redo these fucking tag teams. Stupid ass 2K won't allow you to switch tag teams from universe to universe and from universe to exhibition. So I, I did like 12 tag teams that I've been put together for this universe mode. I'm not finna redo it. I'm not finna redo all this shit. Trash ass game, bro. Bro, had the whole thing loaded up. Everything was loaded. All I had to do was hit start. It kicked me out and then told me that. Fucking. Shit is gone. My whole fucking universe is gone. My whole fucking universe is gone. How is it corrupt? Cause I use custom logos and shit. God damn, bro, this game is ass. You know what? All right, hold on. I'm going to do this. That just pissed me off. Like... Let me see if the regular one. And if this up, I'ma just nope, can't even use that one, bruh.
I know what I'm about to do. So I'm not starting all the way over. So fuck it. I know what I'm about to do. Hold on, y'all. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. That that pissed me off. That man, they got me messed up. That's that's all I'ma say. They got me messed up. I feel like I'm still missing a tag team, but that's I am. I am. I am. Alright, hold on. Hold on, y'all. We gonna get this shit together. I gotta do it like this. I'm gonna do it like this. Give me one second. Appreciate y'all coming through, by the way, with this dumbass game, bruh. I'm pissed, bro. Like highly pissed right now, but I'm finna, I'm finna, I'm just the universe mode that still work. I'm just switching all that shit over right now. That's what, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just changing that to DKL. So we ain't gonna start where I want to start, but whatever. They got me fucked up. I'm not finna restart that whole. I did so much work on that shit, bro. I'm not finna restart that shit over. They got me messed up. They, they really got me messed up. That ain't happening. So give me give me one second. I'm I'm almost done with this. It ain't gonna take me that long. Bro, cause I did so many so many tag teams that you have to redo each universe. That's the part that really frustrates me because you can't just import the tag team over to exhibition and to another universe, which is dumb as hell, 2K. I didn't did, man, nah. I didn't put the match cards, nah. Fuck that. Half of the tag teams are still in my other universe, so I'ma just add the one I ain't got. I'ma add the one I ain't got, and then I'm, I'm starting from there. They, they got me messed up, bro. Hold on, I'm, I'm still, we'll have this shit done in a minute. Sorry, I apologize to the ones that got to sit here and look at me right now while we doing this. I did not plan this for this shit to mess up as soon as I started the stream. I literally been on for 30 minutes with no issues. So... As soon as I started the stream, the bitch started doing that. I'm just in the process of taking off all the titles right now of everybody and switching the shows. That's that's what I'm doing right now for my old universe. And if that shit say it don't work, boy, I'm a, boy, I'm gonna have a fit. <laughs> I'm gonna have a fit. I had a loaded show ready, a loaded show. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, hold on, hold on. <sighs> Man. That's crazy. I am almost 
done. Hold on. Gotta remove these championships. Whew, that's, that's crazy. It's fucking crazy. That is crazy. So mad at that right now. So mad at that right now. It's crazy. composure. I appreciate y'all being patient, man. <laughs> appreciate y'all being patient. I'm highly, I'm highly upset right now. I'm almost done, though. I promise. I'm almost done. To the ones that left, eat a dick. I don't care. Bye. right now so if i do that that's gonna take all day so i'm gonna skip that part and i'll just do it as we go oh shit it's not letting me skip all right hold on let me do this real quick shit. golly it's game bro this game this game this game unbelievable Oh no, I'm I'm taking my own universe mode from and taking the Raw and SmackDown and all that shit and I'm changing it over now to DKF. So I'm not redoing everything over. So I'm just in the process of changing everything over now. I'm almost done. It's forcing me to select like the characters right now. So that's what that's what I'm doing. But uh yeah. We about to start DKF today. That's what I said we doing. That's what we doing. F what they, F what this game trying to do. I just switched the titles and all that over, so we good on that. Uh, I'm just doing the characters right now, and we're done after this. Because it ain't going to take me long to set the show up, because I remember what, what my card was. So I ain't, I ain't really worried about that. At least I remember most of the card. Let me say that. I remember the important matches. Damn, it's about 15 Ray Mysterios. I'm trying to make sure I click on the right one. 
Oh damn, I forgot about some more Joe. Gotta buy set. Yeah, but we doing this today, buddy. We, we getting this done today. Ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about it. It just taking longer to start the show because of BS. Eyes, right, one team I got to create. That's cool. We'll do that next show. That's fine. They just miss out this week. I'm mad about that. I'm mad, bro. I'm mad. <laughs> I'm, I'm mad. Oh, I'm mad. Mm, mm, mm. Almost done, y'all. Almost done. Almost done. 2K is some hoes, I tell you that. I will tell you that. 2K is some hoes, boy. Tested negative twice for COVID, but it sure do feel like I still got it. data stuff again boy I was gonna get mad don't do that let's get this show going hold on <sighs> man we almost there folks we almost there Almost to the main event, y'all. Almost to the main event, getting the car set, and we can start the show. WWE fan, what's good, bro? What's good, bro? Bro, I got the same thing just happened to me when I start the stream, bro. It deleted my whole universe mode, and I'm highly pissed. How was Doctor Strange? Was it, was it good?
Bro, yes. Everything. So what I'm doing now, instead of recreating, I just went to my regular universe that had Raw Smackdown and all that. And I'm I just switched everything over. You had to, to delete every well, nah boy hell nah. Bruh. If I gotta do that, I'm shit, when when AEW coming out, cause uh <laughs> no sir. No sir. No sir. No sir. All the rings are gone too. Wow! Now my rings and title was still there. So this boy, damn, uh, Max, don't say that, bro. Don't don't say that. Good lord. Yeah, I made it, bro. Well, we about to find out. Hold on, I'm finishing up these last few matches that I gotta redo. Uh. And then if it don't work, then yeah. Y'all might see me going to full rage. If that happens, that's that's all I'ma tell you. You might see me go on a full ass rage if that happens. So you have to re-download like characters and all that shit too, bro. If I got to re-download all these characters, that ain't going to happen. I got Young Bucks, Cody. I got I got all these people, bro. I can't I can't do that. I'm missing the title. 1 2 3 4 Wow, bro. Ooh, I hope I ain't got to do that, boy, because I'm about to be pissed <laughs> if I got to do that. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm getting mad thinking about it, brother. Oh, I'm getting mad thinking about it. You didn't contact 2K support? They didn't do nothing? Lost your... Oh, boy. Boy, boy, boy. What did 2K support do? Did you contact them? Of course, that's that's what pissed me off. Cause they be like, oh yeah, contact us and you know, let us know. But every time I hit them up about something, they don't never fix shit. That's all they tell us. They, we are aware of the glitches. But you're not fixing it. Like, what's the point of content? Man, boy, I'm about to go on a rant. About to go on a rant. About to go on a rant. <laughs> about to, I'm about to go on a rant. Oh, man, I'm about to go on a rant. Because 2K know they full of shit, bro. They know they are. Don't even make sense. Yeah, bro, you just made me mad thinking about that, dog. Hold on, I got one, two, two more matches. Hold on.
That's crazy. Like modding is what helped the game. All right. Especially like when we we stuck to play 2K19, like modding helped. Man, that's that's some weird activity right there, bro. That is. Uh, what's this? One, two. I'm actually leave that match alone. I ain't even go touch that one. Let's let's touch this one. See how we go. First episode of DKF. Let's see if it works. DKF in the building. Got a loaded show for you tonight. Loaded show for you tonight. As you see, we are in Bowling Green, Kentucky right now. Hopefully everything works just fine. I hope y'all like the arena, by the way. First week of DKF, what we like to do is, since it's our very first show, we get our titles from Jump, everybody gotta earn their title. So we got a tag team triple threat title match. We got a triple threat DKF women's title match. We got a couple of great matches on the card for you. We have our budget cut triple threat match. Now, if y'all don't know about the budget cut rules, whenever this title is defended, whoever lose will be budget cut and sent to another federation. Bruh. They will have a chance to come back if they win the budget cut money in the bank ladder match. And then we have our main event is a fatal four way for the budget, I'm sorry, for the dope content, world title, Roman Reigns, AJ Styles, Finn Balor versus Umaga. So let's get right to it, load this show. Let's start with the dope content tag team championship match. Get right into it. Make sure I'm not nobody. Please work, please work. I'm gonna get mad if it don't. I'm gonna take myself off screen while the match is on. <laughs> he said prayers up. Facts, let's go. Come on. Come on, come on. As you can see, it's a ladder match, triple threat ladder match. Come on. Let's go. The following contest is a triple threat tag team ladder match. And it's for the world. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 479 pounds, Jimmy and Jay, the Uso. Starting off hot, you can't get no hotter than the bloodline right now. Got the Usos coming out. Trying to see if they can become the first ever dope content tag team champions. They got a tough task at hand versus the Mysterios. 
gonna let the crowd react to him. Tough task in hand versus the Mysterios and Street Profits in the latter match. But that's how we do it. No easy handouts in Dope Cunt in DKL. Mysterio and his son Dominic. Let's see how hot they can start. It'll be a perfect way to start off. First ever father and son tag team champion. And a combined weight of 375 pounds. The team of Dominic and Ray Mysterio. I think these two are the underdogs in this match, honestly. So we'll see if they can pull off an upset. D-Web said, let's go Rey Mysterio. Got some Rey Mysterio fans in the chat. All right. We can't vote on this one, however, because it's a triple threat, and they only let us do two options on the vote. So Twitch, I need you to work on that. But it should be a fire match either way. Coming out last, we have the Street Profits, Montez Ford, D'Angelo Dawkins. And the crowd is on their feet. Listen to their reaction. Crowd is on fire for the Street Profits right now. He said the crowd sounds piped in. This is not WWE. <laughs> this is an authentic crowd reaction here at DKF, Matt. The Street Profits are very popular in DKF right now. They definitely the fan favorites. You can hear it. Let's see if they can pull it off for the crowd. Here we go. Three teams going there. The three of the top teams so far in DKF, even though it's only the first week. You gotta go with the most popular teams. Rey Mysterio and Jimmy Uso are already thrown outside. D'Angelo Dawkins is doing work on Jey Uso right now in the corner. I don't know what Dom is doing. He seems to not want to fight anybody. Now he's getting into the action. Angelo's going up top. Missed with the big elbow. And Jay is outside the ring now. I thought he was going to grab a ladder, but he didn't do nothing. He's just standing there. Oh, Montez Forrest landing in on Dominique. Oh, big insecurity kick by Jay Uso. Jay, this is the perfect time to grab the ladder. You're in the ring by yourself. You're not using common sense right now. I guess he's waiting on Angelo Dawkins to get back in the ring so he can beat him down some more. Angelo comes in, kicks to the gut. Butterfly! Spinning cutter or whatever it's called, yeah. And Montez Ford is still hammering Dominic. Dominic is looking real bad right now. You need a whooping from Rey Mysterio if y'all lose. It's because Dominic, you're getting whooped. You're getting beat down. You're not helping your dad at all. Jay is still in the ring by himself. I'm going to sound like Michael Cole. I'm going to be like, oh, what a maneuver, a lot. <laughs> 
Nice. Springboard and he kind of landed on Jay, on Jimmy. Ray Mysterio, big boot to the midsection. Montez Ford is steady doing work on Dominic outside the ring. I'm surprised nobody has grabbed the ladder yet. Oh, power bombing, thrown Dominic to, the oh, nice cutter on Ray Mysterio. The Mysterios are getting manhandled by both teams right now. Jimmy Uso is bringing the ladder inside the ring. What's gonna happen now? All six men are going at it. Dominic has been getting worked this whole match by Montez Ford. Angelo Dawkins and Jey Uso has been going back and forth. And I don't know why he messed that up. Dominic is still getting worked outside by Montez Ford. Angelo Dawkins hitting the butterfly cutter again. Butterfly neck breaker. Oh, big ladder shot today. Angelo Dawkins about, good Lord. Dominic is out here getting whooped. Bruh. He is not ready for DKF, it seems like. Competition is different here, fellas. Might need to send him a um, NXT or something. Big ladder shot, Montez Ford. Dominic is climbing the ladder. Jimmy Uso is with him. And, uh oh. They're going back and forth on the ladder right now. Big right hand by the, oh, big right hand by Jimmy. Big headbutt by Jimmy, and Angelo Dawkins is in a fan. Oh, he gets kicked off. Bye-bye. <laughs> and down goes Jimmy Uso as well. Angelo Dawkins going to the top. Montez Ford has been going. Oh, big frog splash by Angelo Dawkins. I didn't know he could do that. Monte is like brawling outside apparently because he's whooping everybody outside. Dominic is sneaking up to the ladder right now when nobody's paying attention. Angelo got him. Well, and power bomb with Dominic. Dominic is the worst, by far the worst character in this match. <laughs> Bruh. Big ladder shots. They seem to be jumping. Montez Ford the outside, they're tired of getting beat up by him. Dominic is going back up. He seems to be the only smart one, even though he's not doing anything else. Nice kick to the back by Angelo Dawkins. Big splash by Angelo Dawkins. Another big splash by Angelo Dawkins. Ray Mysterio and Jey Uso going in outside the ring. Jimmy is back up. Elbow shot to the back, elbow shot to the back. I need a co-host. A lot of stuff to call. I'm going to be horse by the second match. Big frog splash on Dumb. Dumb is pretty much out. He is out. Oh, Angelo Dawkins gets sent out. Oh, Ray Mysterio. He missed. I don't know how, but hey. Called high risk for a reason, folks. Oh. Oh, is he busted open? I think Dumb is busted open. He is. He should be. He's been getting beat up by everybody. Now Montez is going out to Jey Uso. Big body slam by Montez Ford. Oh, nice back body drop. Suplex, I should say. That was a back body drop inside the ring by Jey Uso. Nice, on the ladder. Jey Uso is stunned outside the ring right now. Both of the Mysterios have been thrown out. It's not looking too good for the Mysterios. I said they were the underdog coming in, and it's showing to be true. Montez set up the ladder, but Mysterio's are back in. Dom is going back up. He is using common sense right now, but he's getting attacked by Jimmy Uso. Oh, Angelo Dawkins stopped. Dunn is reaching for the, for the titles. He got one. He got two. He got three. Angelo Dawkins, oh, and the ladder fall. Bruh. Oh, 
the ladder falls, and he gets power bombed again. Oh, that was bad. He almost had it. And Montez Ford is thrown out the ring now. Huge body slam by Angelo Dawkins on Jimmy Uso. They outside brawling. I see him. It's going to be funny when Dunn wakes up and comes back to the ring and grabs a ladder while everybody else is falling. While everybody else is fighting outside the ring. I wouldn't be surprised if Dunn is the one that does it. Angelo Dawkins in the ring by herself, grabbing the ladder. Here comes Rey Mysterio. Angelo Dawkins is going up. Montez is trying to fight off the defenders. It's not working. Angelo is hanging. He's hanging. Who's going to grab him? Who's going to grab him? Oh, and it's Jey Uso with a power bomb. Big spine buster by Jimmy Uso. Both of the Usos have been thrown out the ring now. Street Profits in the, oh, they got out the ring. They were the only two in the ring, they got out. Angelo Dawkins is back in, he's back out. Dom is in. Just standing there looking like an idiot. And Montez proceeds to beat him up again. Good job, Dom, you idiot. Montez at the top rope, oh. Nice move. Ray, don't stop your son from doing his move. You look like he's setting him up for something. And Ray proceeds to stop him anyway. <laughs> Ray is climbing up the ladder. We have Jey Uso also climbing up the ladder. Punch to the gut. Montez Ford is going up. Angelo Dolphins is getting beat up outside. I believe he is now busted open after these punches. Big. Woo. It's a lot going on. I'm going to be hoist. Everybody is down. It's been a tough match. It's a four star match already. Just getting started. First match DKF giving you five stars in the making. That's how we do it at DKF. Big clothesline by Dominic. Jay is in the ring by himself, but he's not taking advantage of it. Now he's getting the ladder. Nobody's paying attention to Jay. Dumb is busting open, but he's now doing work on Montez. Jay's in the ring. Jay's climbing up. Nobody's paying attention. They're fighting each other. They're fighting each other. Here comes Angelo Dawkins. Jay needs two more. And the ladder is gone. Big power bomb by Angelo Dawkins. Big DDT by Montez Ford. Dom is now going, never mind, he's reversed. Jey Uso seems to be busted open as well. Big ladder shot by Montez, two of them. Montez sets up the ladder, Rey Mysterio's outside of the ladder. Dom is climbing up, nobody's paying attention to Dom. Oh, never mind, he's not going for the title. Dom is being stupid again, and it cost him. Oh man, I know Ray's gonna watch the highlights of this match if they don't win and be highly pissed at his son. He's making a lot of stupid choices right now. Big ladder shot by Jimmy Uso to Don. Jimmy is climbing up while the rest are fighting. Let's see, can he get it? You need two more, one more. Oh, and we got new champions. <laughs> Let's go. Usos are the first ever DKF Tag Team Champions. Here are your winners and the new World Tag Team Champions, Jimmy and Jay the Usos. Take a look at that Black Diamond Out Tag Team Championship title that the Usos are holding right now. Shout out to the Usos, first ever DKF Tag Team Champions. Oh, good match. Good match. Good match. First match was a banger. 
first match was the finger. Oh, don't do this, 2K. First match was a banger. All right, next up, we have the triple threat match between Jay Cargill, Bianca Belair, and Sasha Banks to determine the first ever DKF Women's Champion. Man, first ever match, five-star banger, triple threat ladder match. That's how we do it here. Let's see if we can get ready for the next one. Still not ready yet. Women are still getting ready to come out. We can't do the pose like we want to on this because it's another triple threat, but I will let y'all vote like this. It just won't be no point. We'll start a poll on who y'all think is going to win. Let's get to the match. Yes, sir, d -Web. We got Bianca Belair coming out first. I really don't know who the favorite is in this match. It's hard to tell. crowd seems to be on fire for Bianca Belair as well. Let's see if these ladies get followed with another five-star match. Jay Cargill making her DKF debut as well. And her opponents, first from Florida, Jade. All three of these ladies are very tough, man. I don't know who is favored to win this. I don't know who the weak, the weak link is either. It should be a very tough match for all three ladies. As Michael Cole would say, it's boss time. I'm not going to say that. I'm going to say here comes one of the goats, Sasha Banks in the building. The crowd seems to be on fire for all three ladies. It should be highly entertaining. And from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks. Shout out to everybody that's attending the first ever DKA, DKF show. Much love to y'all. I hope you enjoy what you see. King said it's boss time. Cooking my, what's good? Welcome to the first episode of DKF. Who you guys think gonna win this match and become the first ever DKF Women's Champion? Let me know in the chat. The EST chant is getting over right now. Okay. Sounds good, cooking my.
Here we go. Bell rings. We got Sasha. I'm sorry. We got Bianca and Jade going at it. Sasha's dancing right now. Two of the strongest ladies ever are going at it right now. Sasha's being smart. Now she's starting to get involved. Bianca has her in a headlock. Setting up for a suplex. She's stalling. She's stalling. Showing that strength. Jade is posing for her. Showing that she squats. Big suplex by Bianca Belair. Jade is going after Bianca now. Got her in the corner. What is she going to do? What is she going to do? Head smashed in the corner. Sa oh, Sasha showing some strength on Jade. Oh, snake eyes to Jade from Sasha. Okay. Big kick to the back of Sasha Banks. Raspberry coffee. Okay, cooking mine. Big, big knee by Sasha Banks to Jade Cargill. Sasha is doing work so far. Bianca's outside celebrating for whatever reason. Big chop by Sasha Banks. Sasha is doing work on Jade Cargill right now. Bianca is just taking her sweet time and letting them beat the crap out of each other. Now she's involved. Jade is stunned outside the ring. Now Bianca's going to work on Sasha. Snake eyes to the corner. Big kick. Big kick by Bianca. Oh, nice reversal by Sasha Banks. These ladies have been going back and forth. They got a history. They got a good history. Anytime they mix it up, it's a classic. Sasha Pan tripping near the Guerrero right there. Big kick to Jay. Sasha is dominating this match so far. Big right hand. Big kick to the midsection. Jade has really got in the offense hand so far. Neck breaking to Jade Cargill. Bianca is still celebrating for whatever reason. Oh, now she has Sasha up. Look at the power by Bianca. Again, ladies and gentlemen, this is for the first ever DKF Women's Championship. Snap suplex by Bianca to Sasha. Jade has a still. There she go. Now she's starting to get some offense in. Never mind. Jade seems to be the weak link so far. And I'm shocked by that right now. Now Sasha is celebrating. She's about to get attacked. Never mind. She reverses it. Snap man. Oh, drop kick to Jade. And Jade is out the ring, stunned. Now Bianca and Sasha proceeds to go at it. Oh, backstabber. Oh. Is she going to tap? Is Becca Bianca going to tap? Nope. She reverses it. Count, Ralph. One. Oh, not even a one count. Nice backstabber into the bank statement there by Sasha Banks. Oh, looks like they're, never mind. Oh, they are double teaming Sasha. Double choke slam. Wow. Nice. Let's see who takes advantage while Bianca is outside the ring. Sasha has been dominating this match so far. Big elbows, big forearm to the back. One, two. Oh, and Jay kicks out. Bianca is now starting to wake up outside. She's back in the ring. Jade is starting to get some offense in on Sasha. Never mind. Sasha reverses. Jade has been getting whooped this whole match. I don't understand it. I'm shocked. Oh, nice. Drop toe hole by Jade Cargill. I don't know what happened there. Nice takedown by Sasha. Jade is out again. Spine buster by Bianca Belair. Oh, Jade is back up. And she's doing push-ups for whatever reason. Nice reversal by Sasha. She's going for the pin. One. And Jade breaks the pin up. Nice chop by Jade. Big chop, big right hand. Double choke slam. 
Ajay, Bianca's in the corner. She's about to get attacked. Pay attention. Jade is going for the pin. One. Bianca kicks out at one. Pretty solid match so far. Oh, Bianca got Jade up above her head. Look at the power. Oh, nice. Bianca going up top. What is she going for? What is she looking for? Jade might be too far away for her to do anything. Yep, and she gets down. Sasha's back in. And Sasha is back out. <laughs> Bianca Belair has Jade up. She's doing some more squats, showing the power. Showing the power with the power slam. Jade Cargill is not a small woman to be doing that to. Nice. I don't know why Jade is celebrating. She hasn't done really much in this match. Oh, we... Jade breaks up the bank statement. And she chooses to celebrate again. What is going on with Jade? Bow, she takes a big knee for celebrate. Bruh. She's, she seems to be too cocky for this match. Sidewalk slam by Jade Cardiello and Bianca Belair. I see nobody voted for Bianca in this match. I see in the polls, everybody voted for Jade and Sasha. Not bad. I thought the Undertaker was coming out. Nice power shown. Snake eyes to Jade by Bianca. Backstabber by Sasha Banks to Bianca Belair. She's going for the pin. Will she become the first ever DKF Women's Champion? Jade breaks it up at the one count. Spinning neck break of the Jade. I believe it's called a... She's setting her up. She's setting her up. Oh, nice reversal. That was important right there. She's setting up for the finisher. Oh, Jade got up. Oh, is that it? One, two, Bianca is stunned, and Sasha kicks out. But that was close. She's going for it again. Oh, and Sasha reversed. Bianca almost lost the title, not even realized. Bull dog by Sasha Banks. Big clothesline by Bianca. All three ladies outside going at it right now. Oh, they double teaming Sasha again. Are we getting an alliance here? Low key? That's the second time they didn't double team Sasha. Oh, Jay goes to the steel steps. Big elbow by Sasha. I hope these ladies know they can't win a title outside the ring. They are going at it right now. Second match of DK. Oh, backflip coming from Bianca. Nice. They, they seem to be jumping Sasha Banks. We might be seeing an alliance here. Or they, they both got some major beef with Sasha. But she's fighting off both of them right now. Now finally, Bianca and Jade are getting into it again. Jade goes to the step. Still steps again. These ladies are going at it. It's been a fire match so far. Didn't expect anything less from these three ladies. Big DDT. What is Bianca doing? Pay attention. Oh. Sasha's going for the pin. One. Oh, one count. Wow. Didn't expect to see a one count at this point of the match. Bianca is very, very resilient. Very resilient.
Bianca is showing that power this whole match. Just carrying Sasha around. And Jay comes in and attacks Sasha. They really don't like Sasha. <laughs> Good Lord. Big power slam by Bianca Belair to Jay Cargill. What is she doing? She's just waiting. She's going to the top rope. Jade is up, though. Nice reversal by Jade. Y'all better take advantage while Sasha is out. Jade seems to be going for a finisher. And she nails it. Oh, rope break. Bruh. Oh, big boo. Scissors kick by... Not scissors kick, I'm sorry. Oh, nice kick by Sasha. Young and stun in the ring. Sasha's going after Jade. Ooh, that was close. That was close. Bank statement was applied. Bianca got out to save the match. Now Bianca's going to work on Sasha Banks' right arm right now. Let's see what the strategy is for that. Jade is celebrating and takes a big clothesline. Uh-oh, Bianca has Jade up for the KOD. Is that it? Sasha is outside the ring. She's going for the pin. She's going to get it. One, two, three. Oh, we got our first ever women's champion. Let's go. Tough match. Another five star match. Bianca Belair is the first ever DKF Women's Champion. Two title matches, two new champions crowned. Show it up, Bianca. Be proud. You did a lot of work. Wee! Fire match. That was an instant classic. So we got a five star and an instant classic back to back here in DKL. And we're just getting started. That was only the second match, ladies and gentlemen. Now next we have Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods of the New Day taking on Joe Quinn Wow and Rael Mendoza of Legado del Fantasma, which should be a good match. Let's get to it. I will be able to let y'all vote on that. Somebody's calling my phone. Hoo wee Very good start to DKR. I believe the guys are ready. Let's get to it. Y'all will be able to vote points on this one. Oh, WWE Universe! Don't you dare be sour! What? Clap for your longest reigning tag champs! And feel the power! What is happening right now? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. That's not the interest they're supposed to have, but whatever. Accompanied by Big E at a combined weight of 417 pounds. Exactly I care none about WrestleMania backlash right now. We're talking about TKF, buddy. WrestleMania rematch, that's what it is. Hell no, nah, I ain't pumped for it. I'm pumped for the watch along we gonna do. That's always fun with uh, get the tables and darts. But the actual show, no, I'm not pumped for it at all. Five minutes to vote on this match. Who you got? New Day or Phantasma? They got on Phantasma. Bet your channel points. I don't know why New Day came out to that generic entrance. Oh, that looks nice. And 
and their opponents, accompanied by Santos Escobar, at a combined weight of 365 pounds, Joaquin Wilde and Raul Mendoza. This is not the entrance, though. It is, but it's not. It's not the triple man entrance. That's what I'm saying. Hey, whatever. Four minutes to vote. Vote them channel points. Don't be scared. It should be another good match between these two teams. got 520 points on a new day right now. 10, somebody's being scary and voting 10 on Phantasma. Somebody's being cheap. Match gets started. Xavier Woods already up against the ropes. Wild is going to work. Dark has put 9K Phantasma. Oh, okay. I don't know why Xavier Woods celebrating the match just started. No Quinn Wilds taking Woods to the corner. Tags in Mendoza. Nice double team move right there. Buddy, I'm sick right now, so trust me, I'm with you. But I promised the people DKF today, so we're doing DKF today. Xavier Woods has been getting work so far in this match. Oh, he went for the springboard DDT and then fell. Big chop. Oh, springboard Insegiri by Mendoza. Didn't know he had that in him. Two minutes left to vote. It's 9,000 on. Uh, Phantasma right now. Kofi comes in and gets suplex. 520 points on New Day right now. Kofi's back up. A nice takedown. Big kick. Tags in Woods already. Woods should stay out a little bit longer in my opinion. But he comes in with a big forearm right there. Nice chop. Nice chop. Nice suplex. Taking Mendoza to the corner. What's gonna happen here? He tags in Kofi. Snapmare takedown by Woods. Big kick by Kofi. Close line by Woods. Big elbow by Kofi. Big elbow by Woods. Nice tag team moves right there. About a new day. Showing you why they wanted the best ever to do it. Kofi's going to the top. Wild is trying to distract him. Big leg drop by Kofi. One minute left to vote. That was close. No Ken Wild saved the, what looks like a victory by the New Day. Big kick, big kick, big punch. Nice reversal by Mendoza. Got Kofi in the corner. He's stumping the mud hole in him. And walking it dry. Look like they're fighting outside the ring. Cameraman should be fired because you can't quite see him. Oh. Nice reverse DDT by Xavier Woods. And Mendoza's going to work on Kofi right now. Big E is stunned. Big E must have got hit by Mendoza as well. Big drop kick by Kofi. The Santos for no reason. Throws him to the post. Big E's getting attacked as well. The ref is counting. The ref is to six. Kofi is attacking Joe and Wild now. They just going at it. It's real beef right here. The voting has ended. 
Let's see who wins these points. Nice takedown by Kofi. Russian leg sweep. I don't know what I don't know what happened there. Kofi seems to be distracted by something. Mendoza is taking Kofi to the ropes. Takes him to the corner. Tags in his partner. Wild is now coming in to the top ropes. Assisted shoulder block. Nice. Oh, springboard back by the. Oh, I'm sorry, back flip. <laughs> oh, wow. It's going for the win. One, two. Xavier Woods did not attempt to help his partner out. He must knew Kofi was going to kick out. You better be glad he did. Kofi's down the corner. Getting hammered. Oh, nice reversal by Kofi. Kofi needs to tag out. He's looking real bad right now. He needs to get the fresh guy in the ring. Nice elbow by Kofi. Oh, Joe King Wild is now busted open. What is Kofi going for here? Breaking his arm across the top rope. Kofi showing a little dirty side right there. Oh, nice move by Joe King Wild. Kofi needs to tag out immediately. Not looking good for Kofi. Nice reversal. Joe King Wilds in the in the corner. Oh, big elbow. Kofi still has yet to tag out. Here comes Mendoza back in the ring now. Great tag team work by Fantasma. Big shoulder block. Oh, another springboard and scary kick to Kofi. Elgato then Fantasma is doing work. Another tag in. Perfect tag team. The quick tags. Look at them. They just look at this. They are putting on a tag team clinic right now. Another dope shoulder block. Kofi is getting work. He needs to tag out immediately. Nice takedown by Kofi. Oh, he goes for the pin instead of tagging out. One. One count. I don't know why Kofi refused to tag right now. He desperately needed it. He desperately needed it. Now he's reaching for the tag. Hot tag. Here comes Xavier Woods. While Mendoza was, oh, and it didn't work. It doesn't matter. Mendoza's going to work. Big move. Excuse me, my bad, y'all. Oh, nice elbow. He's going for the pin, but it's a rope break. Kofi is stunned outside the ring. He's been completely beaten down. Nice. Xavier Woods is now busted open. They are putting on a clinic against the New Day right now. Look at this. Look at this. They are making the New Day look like some amateurs. They are making New Day look like some amateurs. Big splash on Xavier Woods. Sends Xavier Woods to the corner. Tags in Mendoza. Double back body drop on Xavier Woods. They had, oh, nice reversal. Oh, eat the feet. Xavier's putting him to the center of the ring. Can he get the pin? One, 
two. Oh, he kicks out. That's a good thing because his partner did not help him at all. Big suplex by Xavier Woods. Nice drop kick by Xavier Woods. They have to make a comeback here because they be getting dominated this whole match. Tags in Kofi Kingston. Kofi comes in celebrating and he's going to let Mendoza tag out. Stupid, stupid, stupid. This can't be the same team that's considered the most decorated team in WWE history. Oh, now Kofi. Is this the midnight hour? I believe it is. Yes, it is. And he didn't go for the pin. Bruh. What is happening right now? He did not go for the pin. While Mendoza is stunned outside of the ring. Oh my. What is happening? That might cost him the match. Nice suplex by Joe Kim Wow. Big splash. One, two. Kofi breaks that up. Smart move by Kofi. Kofi is now thrown out. He's taken out of the match. He's outside stunned. My controller batteries are low. <laughs> he well said, what the fuck is New Day doing? I don't know, my guy. They're getting whooped. That's what's going on. Oh, 450 splash. One, two. Oh, Kofi barely saves him. He's going back up. Here comes Kofi. Kofi pushes him off. Smart man. Wild is right back up. He's back on an attack on Woods. Has Woods in the corner. Woods with the big elbow. What is Woods about to do here? Spinning that breaker by Xavier Woods. Is he going to tag out? Yes, he is. In comes Kofi. And Kofi spring. And that's reversed. And Kofi is down with the big elbow. Another instant classic match here. Three matches, three five-star matches. That's how we do it at DKF, baby. Big chop. Oh, Kofi with the reverse kick. Kofi is sitting back in the corner. Big elbow by Kofi. Oh, he went for the double stumps and Wild got out the way. Oh, nice reversal by Kofi with the big knee. Oh, trouble in paradise. Is that it? He's going for the pin. One, two, three. Wow, the New Day win. The New Day got completely destroyed. Shout out to everybody that voted for New Day. Let me give you your point. New Day got completely destroyed and beat up that whole match, and somehow they came out with the win. Shout out to New Day. That was huge right there. That is huge. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, let me change Dark is Mad. Dark put 9K on this match. Woo! Woo! Bruh. I don't know what happened, Dark. It was looking good. Three matches in, three five-star classics. We're, on, we're halfway through the card, so I hope you're enjoying DKF right now. 
Give me a quick 30 second minute. Let me go change the controller batteries and I will be right back with DKF. And we are back. <laughs> Let's get to the next match. This is going to be a very physical one. We have Pete Dunn versus Yokozuna. Yokozuna versus Pete Dunn. What up, Dunn? You say out here booking better than something. <laughs> Let's get it, man. It's going to be a tough match for Pete Dunn. All the time, my guy. I'm going to give you five minutes to vote the channel points on this match. Pete Dunn taking on a legend. But Pete said he wants to fight the best. So I'm going to give him a fight here at DKF. Let's go, baby. Here comes Pete Dunn. The crowd seems to be on fire for him. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Birmingham, England. Weighing in at 205 pounds. The Bruiser weighs Pete Dunn. He set this match up because Pete Dunn told me he wants the biggest and the baddest competitors that ever exist to show he's the most badass competitor in DKF. So who I give him first? I give him Yokozuna. Bruh. Five minutes to vote. Let me know who wins. Vote your channel points. Let's see if Pete can pull the upset on Yokozuna today. Crowd seems to be on fire for Pete. Here comes the legend, the Hall of Famer himself. And his opponent from the land of the rising sun, weighing in at 558 pounds. Five hundred and fifty-eight pounds. One of the biggest guys to ever step in the ring. Ah, oh, you good, Cookie Ma? As long as you watching, bro, I'm happy you're here. Four minutes left to vote. I see people scared to vote. I see ten points on Yokozuna, zero on Pete Dunn. Got ten and zero points. Ain't gonna get you no no rewards in this chat. I'll tell you that now. What's up? Yokozuna enters the ring. Yes, sir. Ooh, it's a tough, tough matchup for Pete Dunn, man. Let's see if he can get him to submit or something. It's gonna be hard to get this big man on his off his feet. Now we got 40 points voted on Yokozuna, 200 on. Um, Pete Dunn. Somebody's vote, voting on Pete Dunn. 200. Seems like the crowd is behind Pete. You get a Pete Dunn chance at the beginning of the match. What up, Drew? 
Yoko comes out. You already see the size difference. Pete can't move him. Snake eyes to Pete Dunn. 1.2K on Yokozuna. 200 on Pete Dunn. Two minutes left to vote. This might not be a five-star, man. Might be our first non-five-star match of the week. Oh, big clothesline. Bruh. By Pete Dunn, Yokozuna go over the top row and he's right back up. Let's see if Pete can capitalize on that. Oh, that's what's up, Drew. Nice. Yoko has position on Pete again. Establishing his dominance on Pete. Size difference is just crazy in this match. He's going to the top row. Oh, my. Can the ring hold up on Yokozuna? Whoo, thank God Yokozuna came down. Whoo. <laughs> He's about to break my ring. We still got four matches left to go. <laughs> One and a half minute left to vote. Yokozuna is dominating P right now. Let's see if P can get back in it. Big kick, but Yoko does not go down. Kick, chop, chop, kick. Oh, he tried to grab him. Yoko is just too strong. What the hell was that? I don't know. One minute left to vote. Yoko is dominating Pete right now. He's just too big for this man. Big body slam. But Pete says he wants the toughest every week. And that's, oh, super kick from Yokozuna. So I will give him the toughest every week, no matter if he wins or lose. Asking you, shall receive. Whew, I thought it was over. Got 1.1K on Yokozuna. 200 on Pete Dunn. 30 seconds left to vote. Pete with another, super, with another pump kick. Didn't phase Yoko. Nice snap, man. Drop kick. There you go, Pete. Pete looks like he's trying to fight his way back into this match. He's dragging him to the middle of the ring. Didn't do nothing with it. Oh, big chop by Yoko. Oh, nice. He's just too big for Pete Dunn, man. Nice reversal. Pete got to take advantage while he's down. There you go. Stump to the back. Stump to the back. Big kick. Pete is wearing that right arm down right now. Joint manipulations right now. That's what Pete has to do to stay in this match. Knees to the back. Pete is putting on a good fight. He's putting on a good fight. He's starting to get back into it. No way. No way. Bruh. Wow. One, two. Woo. Almost saw the biggest upset of the week. How did Pete Dunn get that 500 pounder up like that? The drilling must kick in. Pete is going to work now on Yokozuna. Showing just how much of a badass he is. Belly to belly suplex from Yokozuna. You will say holy shit. <laughs> Pete almost pulled one off there. Let's see if he can get back into it. Pete is taking him down by the arm again. Working them joints, working them joints. That's a smart man right there. And that's the only way he's gonna keep Yoko down. One, two. Oh, Yokozuna kicked out a two and a half. This can turn into a four-star match. DK is delivering. DKF is delivering. Everybody's trying to steal the show for the first very, for the very first episode. I said first very, not the dumbass. Oh, he's biting the fingers of Yokozuna. Is he going to get him again? Is he going to get him up again? Oh, no. Is he going to beat Yokozuna? One, two. Yoko kicks out Bruh. again. The crowd is chanting one more time. I don't know how he got him up the first two times. Unbelievable strength by Pete Dunne. Now Yoko is back in control. Big kick. 
double stomp to the midsection. Got another kick. Pete Dunn is starting to go to work now. He's biting Yoko's fingers again. Now I see why he asked for the biggest and the baddest. Pete Dunn said he got something to prove. Hell of an effort by Pete Dunn here. And that effort might be done because Shoko just sat on him. Banzai drop. And the winner is Yoko Zuna. <laughs> Hell of an effort by Pete Dunn there. Here is your winner, Yoko Zuna. Shout out to everybody that voted for Yoko Zuna. That was a hell of an effort. Pete Dunn fought his best. Yoko is just too big for him. <laughs> Dark don't seem too happy about the outcome that. Hey man, P fought his butt off. D Webb said he's 2 0. Let's go. Very good match. Four star match right there. Having Pete Dunn lose on the first show, horrible book. Hey. This, I let them fight. They booked themselves, buddy. <laughs> oh, after all these matches, let's get a match in. The next match is a one-on-one -on -one between Tommaso Ciampa and X-Pac. So we have another legend coming to the ring to fight another up-and-coming superstar, Tommaso Ciampa. Should be another fire match. Let me get the vote set up. All cap. Yeah, King sound like he's mad. All right, five minutes to vote starts now. I believe the competitors are ready. Yes, they are. Let's get to it. I hope y'all enjoying the first ever episode of DKL. Shout out to y'all for coming through. <laughs> Fan favorite Champa is coming out first. The following contest is scheduled oh, X Pac is attacking him from the back. His way to the ring. He's not going to wait. He's attacking him on the ramp. X Pac rocking his neon green DX colors. He must have some real life beef because he said he's not waiting on the entrance. Chumper with the brain buster on the ramp. Big super kick by Chumper. He still got the hood and mask on. He got 510 points on Chumper, 150 on X Pot. Big super kick by X Pot. Three and a half minutes left for vote. Big suplex by Champa on the floor. Still with the mask and the hoodie on. Another brain bust to the floor. Whoa! And it's a no. Wow. Wow. Bruh. Well, that's a no contest match. So nobody gets points there. X Pac decided to jump Chopper for whatever reason. And there's our first question mark. Thanks to X Pac. So there you go. X Pac did not want to wait. And the ref called the match. So. I know it said Champa won, but that was a no, that was a no uh, contest match right there. So moving on, our next match is a tag match between Dakota Kai and Raquel Gonzalez taking on Caden Carter and Casey. 
So let's get into that. Let's get the poll ready while the ladies get ready to come out. I guess they want to save us time. Xbox the Chomper. Let me get the poll ready. If I sound congested, I apologize because I don't feel that great right now. But sick and all, we will give you the show that I promised you earlier this week. So let's go. Five minutes to vote. The ladies are ready. Let's get into it. We got Raquel Gonzalez of Dakota Kai coming out first. Dynamite J was good. Four and a half minutes to vote on this match. The crowd is, I was about to say, they don't seem to be reacting at all to these ladies. But there they go. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, Raquel Gonzalez and Dakota Kai. These two have to be the favorites here in this match, right? Four minutes left to vote. Yeah. 1.5K on Raquel and Dakota. We have 150 points on Casey and Kaden. Let's see if Casey and Kaden can pull out the upset over these two. Still working on women's titles, tag titles, so. We don't have them yet. Lives in the building, what's good? First ever, first ever episode of DKF here. Uh, I think three or four more matches. The crowd does not seem to be reacting to Dakota and Raquel. Every time I say that, they here they go cheering. <laughs> so if you missed the episode, it will be on YouTube as well later on today. But every match has been a five-star match. And Casey Catanzaro. Casey and Kaden coming to the ring. Like I said, they should be the underdogs in this match. Let's see if they can pull out an upset. Two and a half minutes left to vote. They seem to be the fan favorites. They got a better reaction than Raquel and Dakota did. Every match except one, which was the last one, has been at least four stars. So the first, very first DKF has been a very great week. Very great episode. Let's see if we finish off strong. It's very quiet. Why is the ref wearing WWE? I don't know why the ref is wearing WWE stuff right now. Oh, nice. Greenboard back kick by Kate Carter. He said it sounded like the crowd ripped. I think the crowd is still mad about their last match. I think they're still mad about that. They thought it was going to be a fire match, and it was a no contest between X Pac and Tommaso Ciampa. So I think the crowd is still upset about that right now. Or they just don't care about this match. Who knows? They might not care about this match. So hopefully the ladies can make them care. Let's see. Raquel picking up another clothesline coming. The crowd is dead. Another clothesline. Big elbow drop by Dakota Kai. One minute left to vote in this match. She tags, in, I'm sorry, by Raquel Gonzalez. She tags in Dakota Kai. You can hear a pin drop. The crowd is not caring about this match right now. Bruh. <laughs> they better put up a good match or they going to be some booking changes for next week. I can tell you that. 
Hayden Carter's in. Damn, and she throws Dakota Kai outside the ring. The crowd kind of reacts there. Let's see if these ladies can turn it around for the crowd. She went for it again, and Dakota was too smart for it. Stumped to the face, to the back. You say the crowd hating. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Hayden Carter's putting on a show for the crowd. She's starting to get them involved a little bit. You say you can hear them calling out the spots? That's crazy. Oh! Hayden Carter! Bruh. Putting on a show right now. Now the crowd is starting to get involved. Good job, Caden. Up oh, they're dead again. <laughs> So the crowd is just reacting to the hot spots right now in this match. They just want the spots. They don't care about the competitors, apparently. She's going for the pin. One, here comes Kaden. Yeah, yeah, she's going to be flipped. Oh, out goes Casey. Dakota's going after Kaden. Oh, Kaden with the reversal. Dakota's crawling, crawling to Raquel. She gets the tag. And Raquel comes in and does nothing. And Raquel is getting beat up now. She tags in Caden Carter. Oh, Irish whip clothesline. Okay, the underdogs are showing a lot of fight in this match. Big elbow. Oh, look at the power by Caden Carter. She is putting on the clinic. She is putting on the clinic. Might have to get this girl a title shot. The way she's acting right now, she is carrying this match. Out goes Raquel. And she's just standing there. She tags in Casey. What is Casey going to do? Two. She's just standing there. And she lets Raquel get back in the ring. Raquel gets back in. Hitting her with the whip. Well, I thought it was the widow's peak, but it's, it's submission right here. Is she going to tap? Oh, she's showing her power. Nice reversal. Nice way to get out of there. <laughs> nice! Casey with the stunner right there. Big chop. Float over DDT. Nice by Casey. The crowd is starting to get involved a little bit. They're on their feet. They're starting to make a little noise here. Raquel, and she does nothing. Okay, she punched her again. Nice reversal by Casey. Nice reversal by Raquel. Big kick. She going for the submission again. Oh, face buster. Crowd is now on their feet. Starting to make a little noise here. Spine buster by Raquel. Good job, ladies, of getting them involved. False count right there. Kaden comes in. Now she's getting thrown out. Never mind. I don't know what happened there. The ref in the way. The coders in the way. Somebody's in the way. Oh, snake eyes of Kaden. Big drop kick from Casey. What is she calling for right now? What is she going for? Oh, I don't know what that was, but it is okay. One, and Dakota breaks it up. Springboard, I don't know what, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it made sense. She tags in Caden. The crowd has went back dead again. 
Big clothesline by Raquel Gonzalez. Tags in Dakota Kai, which was desperately needed. Big kick, big kick, big kick. Another kick. Oh, another kick. Dakota come in, throwing them feet. She goes for the pin on Caden Carter. One, not even a one count. That's crazy. She's going up to the top rope. Ref is telling her to get down this WWE uniform that she should not have on right now. Nice. She tags in Casey. Quick tags by the two. Casey comes in and nice low drop kick to the leg. Crowd is back on their feet. Oh, that was nice. Spinning cold breaker right there. One, two, and Raquel breaks it up. These two are pulling out some moves. As underdogs, man, they're, they're going at it. What was that noise? Somebody's grunting. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the tag finisher? No, it's not. It's a double back body drop. Nice leg submission there. Here comes Raquel to break it up. But she's just standing there. She's not helping. What some partner you are. And Dakota, fortunately, is able to fight out of it. Big bulldog by Dakota Kai. Nice. Dakota goes for the pin. Here comes Casey. One count. Throws Caden Carter into the corner. She's going for her finisher. It looks like a foul, big boot to the face. Now she's choking her out. She's being very ruthless right now. Very ruthless right now. Oh, face smash. Now she tags out. Here comes Gonzalez for the pin. One, two, Caden kicks out. Good thing, because Casey did not move at all. Caden is back up. What is she going for? <laughs> what was that grunt? Super kick to the leg. She goes up. Another one. Yes, this is my, my own promotion, DKF. She's going for the cover. One, two, Dakota Kyle breaks it up. These ladies are putting on a hell of a match, even though the crowd didn't want to give them a chance to start. We have another four star in the making, maybe a five star here. Way to make up for it, ladies. Oh, she got in the roll up. Casey's not paying attention. One. Okay, Caden kicks out at one. She's rubbing her face to the mat. Big elbow drop by Raquel Gonzalez. Another stump to the arm. Raquel is feeling it right now. She's trying to get the crowd involved. She's trying to get a pump. They're on their feet. Big punches to the face. Crowd did not want to get his match a chance. Now it seems they're enjoying it. Raquel tags in Dakota Kai. What are they looking for here? Another back body drop by the two ladies. Hayden is stunned right now. She needs to tag out this one. Big save by Casey. I don't think Kaden was going to kick out there. Casey's been now throwing out the ring. Dakota Kai is going to work on Kaden Carter. Went for a drop kick, he got reversed. Nice suplex. Oh, oh, okay, Kaden. Kaden 
is showing out this match. Didn't know she had this in her. She's pulling up to the center of the ring. She's going to go for the pin. Nope, she's going for another submission. Here comes Raquel to break it up. Casey's trying to stop her. Big drop kick. Oh, and Dakota Town. <laughs> Casey and Kaden Porter upset. Wow. Shout out to everybody that voted for Casey and Kaden. That is an upset right there. And we got almost a five, almost a four-star match. So it's still considered great. The crowd did not want to get this match a chance. But hey, they, they got you interested in it. Nice. So shout out to the ladies for that. Shout out to the ladies for that. All right, moving on, we have another ladies match. We have three matches left, two title matches and one regular match. So we're on our seventh match and we have nine matches for the first ever week. We had to do it big this week like a pay-per-view. Um, this is a normal match between Nikita Lyons and Britt Baker. Nikki Nikki, as y'all like to call her in the chat and Dr. DMT herself. Let's get ready to vote while the ladies get ready for their match. I know who the underdog is, but let's see if we can get another upset here. Poll is now open. Five minutes to vote. The key to Lions versus Britt Baker. The ladies are still getting ready. Shout out to everybody that came through. <laughs> Hope y'all enjoying this fire episode of DKF. First ever episode of DKF. So a recap real quick. The Usos became the first ever DKF tag team champions in a ladder match defeating uh, Street Profits and the Mysterios. Bianca Belair becomes the first ever DKF Women's Champion by defeating Jay Cargill and Sasha Banks. And we have two title matches left. The ladies are ready, so let's get it going. The American Cream, wow. Here come the key to Lions. The following contest her face. is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from New York, Nikita Leah. Nikita Leah. <laughs> yes, Nikita Lions, Nikki Nikki is in the building. She's real sassy right now with her attitude. Three and a half minutes left for vote. We got 540 on Britt. We got 130 points on Nikki. Three minutes left. And from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Brittany Baker. Here comes Britt Baker. She should be the favorite in this match. Boy, because those dances have been horrible. She feeling herself way too much on the internet. <laughs> Britt Baker in the building, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if Nikita Lyons can pull off the upset. Showing all her skin and whatnot. She comes out with the big kicks. Big elbows. She's coming out hot. Britt with the reverse. Nice takedown by Britt. 
Big chop. She has the key up against the ropes. Big elbow. Another big elbow. Nikki Nikki is not looking too good right now. Britt is hammering down, hammering down. Hammering down, hammering down. Good Lord. This must be, she must have some personal beef with her. Another right hand. Key the lines with reversal. They're throwing haymakers right now. These two ladies must have some beef backstage I don't know about. One and a half minutes left to vote. Big knees, big knees. These ladies are going at it. Oh, big boot. Bruh. Good Lord. Good Lord. They are throwing haymakers early. Nice suplex on the outside. It must be some beef backstage. I do not know about them. They are throwing haymakers. One minute left to vote. Britt with the reversal. Russian leg sweep. Not the Russian leg sweep, but you know what I mean. And Nikki is just watching Britt celebrating in the corner. Nikki is back in the ring. Britt is dragging her to the corner right now. Head first to the top turnbuckle. She has the upside down. What is she about to do? Nice kick. It's a lot of punching and kicking in this match. They are going at it. I haven't seen too many body slams and wrestling moves yet. Oh, back body drop and Nikita is back outside. Britt is going up top. What does she have in mind? The poll has now closed, so if you didn't vote, oh well. Double axe handle off the top ropes to the floor by Britt Baker. Oh, she's about to snap her arm back. Oh, man. Two. Peter has Britt. Throws him to the ground. Big kick by Britt Baker. And she goes right back outside the ring. She broke the count just so they can fight some more on the outside. She's carrying Britt to the corner. Oh, right on the metal railing. Snake eyes. Now Nikki breaks the count and goes back outside so they can fight some more. Big right hand. Back suplex to the floor. These ladies are going at it early. Rip picks up and goes back in the ring. Now she's pandering to the crowd. She's very arrogant. Three. Nikki back in. She takes a boot to the gut. Another boot to the gut. And she's going for the curve stomp. Oh, she hits her with the curve stomp. Is it over? One, two. The key to Lions kick out. Very physical match between these two ladies. Uh-oh, she's going for her finisher. Is she going to tap? Is Nikita going to tap? And Nikita taps. The winner is Big Baker. Shout out to everybody that voted for Britt Baker. She was the she was the favorite to win that match. Nikita did put up a hell of a fight, but it wasn't enough to get the victory over Britt Baker. So shout out to everybody that voted for Britt. Two matches left. Two matches left, and they're both title matches. So first we have triple threat match for the budget cut title. Cody Rhodes versus Seth Rollins versus Bobby Lashley. Now, if you wasn't here earlier and you don't know the rules about the budget cut title, whenever this title is defended, the losers will automatically be budget cutted 
and sent to Impact or another federation. So whoever loses the match will be budget cut. Now, they will have a chance to come back if they win in a budget cut ladder match. Money in the Bank ladder match. That's the only way you can come back. So, budget cut title, baby. Budget cut title, baby. You're instantly cut. So, Seth Rollins, Bobby Lashley, or Cody Rhodes will be cut. Depending on who wins. But they will have a chance to come back next week once the other two losers fight each other. Appreciate the follow. I believe the competitors are ready, so let's get into it. We can't vote on this one because it's triple threat, unfortunately. So let's go. First coming out, we have Seth Rollins himself. This is my personal, I think he's the favorite in this match. The following contest is a triple threat match. It is for the World Championship. Making his way to the ring, from Davenport, Iowa. We gotta burn it down in the chat. You got Seth Rollins fans in the chat. It's a very important match. The losers will be fired. Told you we don't play no games at DKL. Coming out next is Bobby Lashley. The almighty. It's gonna be hard to take this man down. He actually should be the favorite instead of Seth. First from Colorado Springs, Colorado. Weighing in at 273 pounds. The almighty Bobby Lashley. I'll be struggling to spell Roman Reigns, man, but crowd is crowd is all on Bobby Lashley's neck right now. They are on his neck. Two of the competitors in the ring. Next is Finn Balor. Oh, I'm sorry. Cody Rose. I'm sorry. I forgot who I put in the match. From Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 258 pounds, Cody Rose. You know Cody Rose need that power roll. Man, say I gotta have my power in the spotlight on me. He got music for whatever reason is low. I forgot Cody was in this match that fast. So you got your money on Cody? Okay. You 
better hope he win because he going to get cut if he don't. Crowd seems to be behind Cody. He has to be the fan favorite here. Between the three. and burn it down as the match is about to start. There it is, y'all, the budget cut title. The winner gets to keep his job, and he's the champion. The two losers will be cut, and will have to fight their way back to the DKF promotion. Cody and Seth go right at each other, as you would expect. Cody's not wasting no time going out to set. Now Bobby is getting involved. I appreciate it, Chris. I've been, it took me a long time to get that title. Somewhat how I want it. So <laughs> Bobby is carrying around set. Cody is celebrating, pandering to the crowd. Bobby is hammering on set. Cody is not paying attention. Big right hand, big chop. Big chop. They're both going after Bobby now. Big drop kick, but Bobby did not go down. Bobby's taking advantage of Cody right now. Big chop. Ooh, nice. Crowd is chanting something I can't quite make out what they're chanting right now. Oh! And Bobby is now stunned outside the ring after the big kick to Cody. Face busted by Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins, oh, big kick, forearm to the face. What is he going for? What is he calling for right now? Cody drops to the knee. Seth is just kind of waiting. Miss, oh, back kick to the back of the head of Cody. Set goes for the pin, and Bobby has saved his job and the title. Cody with the roll up. And the ref just stopped. Maybe because it's a WWE ref and it's not the ref that's supposed to be there. Bruh. Who's paying this guy to be here? Because I'm not paying him. That's not the referee I asked for. Big body, big suplex by Bobby Lashley. Set, nice suplex. Cody is celebrating. Oh, what is this? He, can he get him up? He got him up. Oh, drops Bobby on his head. Seth Rollins. Thought he was going for net break. Whoa, it's a big forearm to the back of the head of Cody Rhodes. Cody's now stunned outside of the ring. Seth is going for the curb stump on Bobby. And he connects. Is he going for the pin? What is he doing? Go, he's pulling him to the center of the ring. He could have pinned him while his back was in the corner, though. What are you winning? One, two. Oh, and Bobby kicks out at two. Cody's back in now. Flat liner, Seth Rollins. And we got two people celebrating for whatever reason to the crowd, pandering to the crowd. Set with the reversal. Shot to the back leg. Bobby's back in the picture. Going for the suplex. Set with a big knee. I don't know what Cody was doing right there. Is he going for the razor's edge? Paying homage to Scott Hall. Cody with the razor's edge on Seth Rollins. And Seth is now out. Oh, what was that? 
DJ Hyper, appreciate the follow. Welcome to the first episode of DKF. We're in the last two matches. Cody's going for it. Oh, set the stun outside the ring. Will Cody win? One, two, three. Oh, Cody is the first ever Bucket Cut champion. Y'all know what that means. Here is your winner and new world champion, Cody Rhodes. Lizzie say we ended racism, baby. He pinned the black guy though, Lizzie. Cody Rhodes is the first ever budget cut champion, which means Bobby Lashley and Seth Rollins have been budget cutted from the DKF. Bruh. Wow. It was only a three star match. That match was quicker than expected. But shout out to Cody Rose. Keeping his job and the champ. So Seth Rollins and Bobby Lashley will have to fight their way back to the DKF brand. And the way the only way you can do that is by winning the DKF, I'm sorry, the budget cut money in the bank briefcase, which will allow you to cash in on the budget cut champion at any time. And if you cash in and win, you are the new champ, you get your job back, and the previous champ will be budget cutting Bruh. so shout out to cody rose now we are off to the main event we are here to crown our first ever dkf world heavyweight champion and in this match we have a fatal four-way between finn balor aj styles roman reigns and umaga so this will be a fire match <laughs> Shout out to everybody that joined today for the DK first ever DKF episode week one. Um, I was gonna do my impact as well, but if you joined earlier, you saw that 2K pretty much deleted everything, so I gotta restart impact all over. So we'll see how long it takes me to do that. Hey, Derek, appreciate the follow. <laughs> Welcome to the DKF first episode we are on the main event right now i believe all the competitors are ready i wish y'all could vote on this one but since it's a fatal four-way twitch won't allow me to put that many people let's get to the main event the competitors are ready let's go i'm gonna plan on doing this at least once a week first coming to the ring is aj styles very popular character in DKF. You know what? I'm gonna put two, I'm gonna let y'all vote points. So I'm gonna put two names. So either it's Finn or AJ, or it's gonna be Roman Reigns or Umaga. That's how we gonna do it. So I'm gonna give y'all five minutes to vote. AJ or Finn, Roman or Umaga. That's how we go do it since it's the main event. And I'm gonna give y'all five minutes to vote starting now. Let's go. <laughs> so vote your points. Next, we got Roman Reigns coming out. DJ said Finn Balor. The tribal chief, the head of the table coming out. Will this be a complete night for the bloodline? The Usos won the first tag team championships earlier tonight. Let's see if Roman can complete it. It's coming out with a needle moving shirt. Representing the Usos. From Pensacola, Florida, Uso. weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns! You 
got 110 on Roman and Numaga, zero on AJ and Finn. Three minutes left to vote. Three and a half minutes. 110 on AJ or Finn. It should be a hell of a main event here. I know Roman gonna take his sweet time getting to the ring. Tribal Chief said, y'all go wait for me. 161 on AJ versus an Orphan. Still 110 on Roman Omaga. Three minutes left for vote. Now we got 261 on AJ or Finn. Two and a half minutes left for vote. Who's coming out next? Oh, we have Umaga. Oh no, this is Finn Balor. I love this entrance, man. A real big fight feel here. Yeah, look at that entrance. Hell of an entrance by Finn Balor. I don't think nobody has a better entrance than him. Maybe Robert Rue, maybe. The Prince is here, baby. One and a half minutes left to vote. You got 420 on AJ or Finn. Still got 110 on Roman and Umaga. Don't get more, much better than that right there, people. This is basically the Bullet Club versus the Samoans. Even though it's every man for themselves. Finn looks prime and ready for his match. Thirty-five seconds left to vote. Here comes the monster himself, Umaga. And from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at three hundred fifty pounds, Umaga. It's gonna be tough to get Umaga out of the ring for this match. My prediction is Umaga actually becomes the first champion. But we will see. It's a lot of tough competitors in this ring. Looks like he just scared the whole crowd. Scary man right there, ladies and gentlemen. First ever DK World Champion. Y'all see what the Black Diamonds had to give it a different feel. Got the DK all over it. All four competitors seem to be ready. 
Let's get it on. Oh, and look who's going after each other. The Bullet Club and the, and the Samoans. Interesting. Dang. They want to drop kick to the back, AJ. Big chop by Ben. ADT to Umaga. Roman is going to work on it. Never mind, AJ is going to work on Roman. Sling blade by Finn. Drop kick to Umaga. Okay, AJ is doing work on Roman right now. Face first goes Roman. The Bullet Club members are doing work right now. Umaga's back on his feet. Pin with the back elbow. AJ hits the ropes. Misses the leg drop. Pin is doing work on Umaga. Roman with a big suplex to AJ. Roman is celebrating. Now it's him and Finn alone in the ring. Finn back kick. Finn is doing work. Got Roman into the corner. Is he going for the double drop kick already? Yes, he is. He goes for the pin while Umaga and AJ is fighting outside. Two count on Roman Reigns. Ben might take this early. Now Roman is back up. Oh, he went for the, <laughs> Ben got out the way. Another sling blade by Finn. And he's going back to the top rope. Is he going for the coup de grace? Oh, Roman gets out the way. Roman and Umaga getting into it now. AJ. Fast paced moving match here. Oh, the hot Samoa drop on Roman. He's going for the pin. One, AJ breaks up the count. DDT to Amaga by AJ Styles. Once again, this is the main event. This is for the world title. The crown of first ever DKF world champion. AJ and Roman have now been it. Never mind, Roman is back up. Umaga has spin on his shoulder. What is he gonna do with him? Oh, the Samoan driver. Roman with another suplex to Umaga. Umaga's not out the ring. Take advantage, Roman goes for the pin. Oh, Finn, one, two, oh! Bruh. Finn barely escapes. Superman punch. Finn Balor. I don't know what AJ is doing, but he better get it together and stop pandering to the crowd. Roman is going to work. Umaga is just kind of standing outside. Oh, nice submission. Is Roman going to tap? Is Roman going to tap? Umaga is coming in to save it. Belly to belly suplex to AJ Styles. Roman and Finn are down. Umaga's taking advantage on AJ right now. Big head but AJ Styles. Big lead to AJ Styles. Finn is back in, going away from Roman Reigns. Finn is applying a submission. Is Roman going to tap? Some more drop to AJ. A lot going on in this match. It's already almost a four-star match. These men are battling. Big back breaking from Umaga. I don't know what fan is pandering to the crowd for when you got Umaga doing work right now in the ring. Oh, is he going for the Samoan spike? Yes, he is, and Finn is out. He's going for the pin. AJ is stunned. Here comes Roman. One. Two, Roman breaks it up. Roman, big headbutt to Umaga. Roman is attacking this, this spike. Back kick from AJ Finn Balor. Another back kick from AJ to Finn Balor. Pick some more and drop to Roman. 
these four men are going at it. So much action to keep up with right now. Snake eyes to Roman from Umaga. AJ is now on the sun outside the ring. I don't know what happened there. Umaga with the reversal. Finn with the reversal. Big chop, big punch. Uh oh, man, in the, he's in the ring with the, the Samoans by himself. Fighting for pride right here. Roman said he's the head of the table. He's going to show it. These four men are going at it. I don't know what that was, but it kind of connected. AJ's fanning into the crowd while Finn is going out the Umaga. Now it's Finn and AJ. You got two. You got Roman and Umaga stunned. AJ is going for the phenomenal forearm. And he lands it. Can he get the pin in time? Roman is getting up. One, two. Oh! Finn kicked out. He's going for the phenomenal forearm again. Nails it again, but Roman is back in the ring. He's celebrating. Roman breaks it up. We have an instant classic on the way. Uh oh, Finn is about to be hit. Finn has been here with everybody's finisher. He managed to reverse. But number the four on. Oh, but Finn is going for the pin. Woo! And interesting, y'all. AJ's going for the pin. Ralph, well, he's going to get over there. One, two, three. Wow! AJ <laughs> is the winner in the first ever TKF champion. Shout out to everybody that voted for AJ Styles or Finn Balor. Take your point. Wee. Man. <laughs> Fire first episode of DKF. Man, I appreciate everybody that came through today. Trying to, I'm look, I'm looking at my universe mode now and hope that it's save and don't come back corrupt Bruh. like you did last time because it was very corrupt. So to give you a recap of the first ever episode of DKF before we leave, the Usos are now the first ever DKF tag team champions by defeating, let me show you the screen, by defeating Rey Mysterio, Dominic Mysterio, Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins. First ever women's champion is Bianca Belair by defeating Jade and Sasha Banks. The New Day in a very tough match gets the win over um, Elgato Del Fantasma. Yoko Zuna in a very tough match got the win over Pete Dunne. Pete Dunne said he wants to fight the biggest and toughest every week. So we start him off with Yoko Zuna. Tommaso Ciampa and X-Pac went to a no finish because Ch X Pac attacked Ciampa during the entrance. Kaden and Casey gets the victory over Dakota Kai, Raquel Gonzalez. Uh, Britt Baker defeats Nikita Lyons. Cody Rhodes saves his job and becomes the first ever budget cut champion by defeating Seth Rollins and Bobby Lashley, who now is budget cutting from DKF. And the main event, which you just saw, AJ Styles defeated Roman Reigns, Finn Balor, and Umaga to become the first ever DKF world champion. Fire show. I appreciate y'all coming through, man. I appreciate y'all coming through. Much love to y'all. Appreciate the new follow. Let's go. Appreciate everybody that uh, came through and betted points and yada yada so much. We started off rough because uh, 2K completely deleted my universe mode, which was trash. Bruh. So that's why we're not doing impact today as well because. 
2K deleted everything, so I gotta redo that all together. I'm trying to see who's live. Uh, nobody is really live right now. Nobody that I follow. So yeah, okay. So it will be on YouTube later on today. I just gotta save it from here and put it on YouTube. But shout out to everybody that came through and stuck it out with me. Be safe. Let's go. We might. We might do impact later tonight and another episode of DKF. It depends. Like I said, I haven't been feeling well. I've been feeling kind of bad. So um, I'm about to go drug up on some more medicine. And hopefully I feel better and we'll do it later. Max, I definitely will, bro. I'm going to be pissed off if I got to redo everything like you had to, bro. So um, I'm going to go drug up on some medicine. And hopefully everything will... Hopefully it'll work, man. I've been, I've been feeling like crap. So if I sound congested and yada, yada, man, my fault. I appreciate y'all sticking it out. Hope you enjoyed the show. We got more to come. Um, yeah, it's about to be fire, man. Impact is about to be fire, too. So come through. And Impact members are part of DKF, too. Um, they all join. So, But if you get fired from DKF, you get to go to Impact. So you still got a job. It's just not DKF until you get the DKF job back. So... Y'all be safe, man. Have a good one. I'll see y'all later.